I think it's a great opportunity for St. Louis. That will be known, just like Cortex is and T-Rex. Right here on News 4 this morning, I've reported on the thousands of technology jobs worth millions of dollars the business community has reaped from the startup scenes at the Cortex Innovation District in the Central West End and the T-Rex Building in downtown St. Louis. So now let me take you to Creve Corps, where scientists imagine a better St. Louis as an international science center. What are you looking at here? The best amplification of that gene. Mohamed Alfatoli is supervising a group of very smart scientists at Benson Hill Biosystems. What's your PhD in? Uh, my PhD is in molecular biology and plant physiology. They're busy boosting the agriculture business by helping farmers feed more people using ways that are faster. Part of a growing trend of putting more technology in into agriculture. agriculture. Uh, uh, that is correct. This Moroccan 10-year veteran of Monsanto is fairly new to this four-year-old startup that sprouted up so much in size, it's in the process of moving from the Helix Center Biotech Incubator to the Bio Research and Development and Growth Park, or Bridge Park. All this scientific action is underway in Creve Core, which could become the world's center of plant science if the St. Louis Economic Partnership has a say. There are 750 plant science PhDs basically on that corner at that intersection. The intersection of Olive and Lindbergh Boulevards is internationally known when you think about it. It's where you'll find the global headquarters for Fortune 500 agribusiness Monsanto across the street from the Donald Danforth Plant Science Center. St. Louis is positioned to be the best city for agriculture, uh, I, I would venture to say, in the world. If you think about being in the ag um, industry, you gotta be in the Midwest. I can't think of any, any better city than St. Louis. Now, those who are in the business of growing jobs are using a half million dollar federal grant to plant the seeds for a plant science innovation district. The corporate, residential, and commercial complex would transform a local corner into a global connector. You know, I've seen companies come around here from, you know, places like, like India, like Israel. It's very exciting stuff going on here. And the U.S. Department of Commerce gave St. Louis County a half a million dollar grant to develop that master plan, really? which should be completed by the end of the year. Very but cool. there's so many things that St. Louis has. I mean, we have the biggest concentration of plant science PhDs right here. That is really unbelievable. In, in the world. I love what you said, that it's internationally known. International. Free core. That's right. Places. Who knew? Right here. Thanks, Andre.